Hello, my crafty friends. Nana Kay here with NanaKayDesigns.com and the Altered Book Nook on Etsy. Um, I'm going to do a little different video than I normally do. Excuse me, I keep getting something wrong with my computer. I, I don't know what it's doing. So bear with me a second. Yeah, it keeps it keeps going off, and I want to see what I'm recording. All right, you see some things on my desk. And what I'm going to do different today is I am going to actually do a thank you because something happened to me that has never in in my <laughs> in my life or in my life of journaling and doing videos it has just happened but a couple of videos back a few videos back I'm, I was working with some washi tape on my one of my designs and I made mention I said Lord I gotta go buy some washi tape because I just don't have enough variety and it was like a week or two later, a couple, might have been, yeah, about a week or two after I published this, I got this in the mail. Nobody put their name on it. They don't know who it came from, but somebody drop shipped these washi tapes to me. So, uh, whoever you are, I want to thank you. It was one of the most pleasant surprises I believe I've ever had. I would have loved to have had a, a note from you, but I realize you just drop shipped it directly from wherever you got it from, and that whoever it was, if you requested a note, they didn't put it in. So, I would love if you would um, comment somewhere on one of my videos and let me know it was you, because I really want to reward you for, for rewarding me. But I'm gonna, I haven't opened these, so I'm going to bring them out. These are really pretty. Um, they're they got some texture to them and they're also very shiny so I really like these that that's one set in here this set doesn't look like it's as shiny it kind of looks like it's no it is it's a really really light light glitter effect hold on my computer is still cutting up guys this is aggravating the mess out of me okay so this has got a really light kind of glitter effect real thin but they're cute. They're really pretty. And then these again are more patterns. I think it's an exact, not exact duplicate of that, but some of the same are, are duplicated in there. And there's some different. And they might be all exactly the same. But anyway, I got that. So I really appreciate that. That's a nice gesture. And in that pack also, God, I know this was a relatively expensive set. Um, this came in the also with that same gift um i've never had washi tape this wide i don't know what it's called but it's really this is called the travel guide so it's got a lot of neutral colors and a lot of gold and i love gold i love to use washi tape that has gold in it so this is going to be probably one of my favorites i'm not sure how i'll use this and i haven't even tried to open it but i'm going to try and hell to see if i can unroll a little bit of it it is tight on here I don't want to mess it up. I don't want to spend a lot of my time on my video messing though. But anyway, it looks like it's going to come up. Uh, again, I want to say thank you, whoever you were, because I've never had any washi tape like this. And it feels like it's really strong. But that's a really wide one. Of course, I can cut it down and use it in strips. I love it. And then I've got just the strips like these. There's the well, I shouldn't have put that back in. There's these thin ones like this. Quarter inch. And then about the half inch. And the three quarter inch. So there's different sizes. These have writing on it. This one has a lot of tickets like, you know, airplanes and things. This has got the beautiful measuring tape, which I love to use. Um, more tickets on this next one. Guys, it's just really a beautiful set. I really... I really appreciate whoever was kind enough to think about me. I, I mean, I could have bought my own, but, but thank you. I wasn't asking. I wasn't asking you guys to send me washi tape, but, you know, a random act of kindness is nice to receive every once in a while because there are times I'm here I feel like I'm just not successful and, you know, I get down, especially sick as I've been lately. All right, I haven't even opened this one to look what it's like, guys. So we're going to open it together. This like these three, these four were in this this first pack that I got. This one is loaded with washi tapes. Okay, so this is the first you're seeing it the first time that I'm seeing it. So I'll pull them out and look at them. Oh my goodness, there's a pile of them in here. All right, these are. 
I can't read what it says. It just says something. Not 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 code me. Washi tape. Um, it's got like coffee designs on this one. This one too. So this must be kind of a coffee theme. Oh, and I love it. There's the cocoa beans or the coffee beans. That one said, actually has a coffee word. Oh, and I'm a coffee fanatic. So somebody know might be on my Facebook page too because they know I like coffee. I'm a coffee creek. Oh, yes. Look at these beautiful washi tapes, guys. Oh, I love them. I love them. Thank you, whoever. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Got one more. This is also called Travel Time. So it's probably got a lot of neutral colors. It's also by Nakomi, whoever produces that. So let's pull this out. Now, like I say, this was just a really, really nice surprise. Pull these tapes out. They don't want to slide out on their own, and I don't want to mess my box up. But they are in there good. This company really packs their stuff tight. All right, there's two more. Come on. I can't get them out. Uh, there we go. I bet if I get these out, they probably won't go back in. There we go. All right, these have got a lot of neutral colors plus light blues. Uh, trains, cars on this one. Looks like looks like you can split them in half or use them as a long strip and cut that down. This is a beautiful blue with balloons and compasses. This is all words like fragile and tickets and things. Same thing here. Looks like tickets and stamps. Very neutral. Looks like a map strip. Uh, this one's got maps on it also. That one's got maps. Yeah, I like this. This has got ocean scenes with boats and things on it. Oh, this has got music. That's another one of my favorites. Music, music, music. And this has just balloon, hot air balloons also. So, that was what came in that uh, rack, rack, um, at random act of kindness that was sent to me. And I appreciate it. And there again, I say, whoever you were, if you would, if you want to be known who you were, sometimes people want to see them things and don't want nobody to know who did it. And that's okay, too. Um, but thank you very much. I did want to do this video in case you were watching to make sure I got it. And I did get it. And I will use it. And I promise you'll see me using it in some of the videos we're doing. Okay. The next day or two after I got this, I got this in the mail. A little gift box. It, it's got washi tape also. Again, it was drop shipped. Don't know who sent it. But this is a beautiful set of butterflies. Washi tapes. A lot of variety here. And I love butterflies. So this is going to come in handy. All sizes here. My grandson's already had a look at these. And he likes, he says they're tattoos. So he, he did snitch one off this roll right here and put it on his arm. So he's already got a butterfly tattoo on his arm but there again that that one came whoever sent this one if you want to know who need to know who you are um make a comment on one of my videos because i don't know who sent it and then yesterday got this one in the mail i know it came from california that's all i know doesn't say who it's from at all but it came yesterday and it's just a large variety of stamps that are butterflies in the gold fleck. It is absolutely gorgeous. So you know what? We're going to open it. Let you see them. Guys, you've got to see these. These are absolutely beautiful. It's got a green tone with the butterflies, gold flecks. I'll get it up closer to the video thing. You can see it. You can't almost because it's almost a glare on it. But that's in green. Then I got one that's mostly blue. I got pink, yellow, a purple, and a dark, a light purple, and dark purple, like a maroon, and another color purple. So there are lots and lots of these here. We're going to knock them out now. I didn't open them too much because I, my daughter said, Mom, you got to go and make a video and let people see what people have sent you. So there those are again. No name, guys. I don't know if that is a common way people send gifts to um, people, but anyway, whoever sent it, I want to thank you very, very much for sending this to me, and um, I had to just get on here and show you this in the first part of my video. 
Now, this is not all we're going to do in this video, because um, this one didn't take me like 10 minutes to show you. I'm going to get me something and put all my washi tapes in it. Hold on a second. If I can find the empty bucket up here, which is not always easy to do. I'm going to drop all this down in this bucket right here, because I want to show you something that I bought to try out. And let you see some variety and stuff that I use in my shop when I'm doing my videos. I'm just excited. I, I've never had this many washi tapes at one time in my life. I just, oh man, I'm just so excited about these washi tapes, guys. These are just so beautiful. And again, thank you, thank you, thank you, everyone. Please let me know who you are. I would love to see you in one of my um, digital kits. Yep. I would love to see you in a digital kit. Okay. Now our next part of our video, here we go. I got a chemo haul. I haven't even opened it yet, so we're going to open this one together and see what's in here. Okay. Big, big honky scissors out here. Oh, I have no idea what I ordered, guys. I just ordered, I got on there one day. I've seen so many people do these hauls and so much nice stuff, I wouldn't see what's in here. And, of course, I had already ordered me some washi tape before all this stuff come in, so I think there might be some in here. <laughs> And I'm going to have a lot of it. So there's one. I knew I had ordered washi tapes. Alright, this one is, um, I think it's a uh, nature one. That came in, that this kit. This says label age. I have no idea what this is. So let's go in and look at it. I don't even know what it is. I, like I say, I went on Chimu and I went crazy. They gave me a big, uh, uh, Big coupon, 100% off something. So I got one thing, buy one thing, got one thing free. So I just went crazy and ordered things I like. And I just see how good we like Timu. So far, so good. I don't know what this is. I can't seem to get in it. Let me get my little knife here. Break this label. There we go. What is in here? Okay. <coughs> Labels. Excuse me. White and black. All kinds of labels, guys. This is this is cool. So every kind of shape you can think of. Let's just pull out a handful and just kind of look at them. Yeah, a lot of variety here. These will be great on what I call my stacks. I make stackables. <coughs> just to sit on the side. Excuse my coughing. I've started getting really sick again, y'all, and I, I, anybody that believes in prayer, I would love you to pray for me. I've been to the doctor today, and they're worried that I've got some kind of a bad autoimmune disease, and they're, they're running some tests. But that's all right. It's not going to stop me because I'm just that way. I'm just determined. All right, these are kind of a coffee color. Oh, there's some, there's some blue in there, too. There's a good mixture here. These are really cute. Aren't they gorgeous? Oh my goodness, I love these. This was some kind of label pack. Label aid. Oh, label aid. So, these are just really nice. Hey, that's going to save me a whole lot of fussy cutting because I usually fussy cut much of these. Just a lot there. These will last me a long time. We're going to get busy doing some stackables with that one. Guys, that was a cool one. All right, what have we got here? More washi tape. This has got the gold flex in it. I might have even ordered one of the ones that we got. I don't know. Um, I'm not sure what this one was, but it's got fruit and vegetables. It kind of looks like maybe herbs. This herb, herb one. What is this? I don't know. Let's open it up and see. This is going to be a job putting all this up and finding somewhere to put it. All right, this says wilderness remains, so I'm not sure if this is washi tape or something else. And I'm going to go ahead and open it because I'm curious. I know you are, so let's see what's in here. I tell you, if you can get one of the coupons from um, these people that's 100% off of some things, yeah, grab it because you can really get a lot of stuff bang for your buck that way oh these are just really um soft these are very soft textured colors here 
mechanical. I'm sure that's what all this is. Washi tapes. Oh, I love these. Very soft colors. So that's one I ordered for myself. If I had known I was going to get all them gifts, I probably wouldn't have ordered all this washi tape. But that's all right. You know what? We're going to use it. Let's see if we got any more washi tape in here. Uh, there's another one that's more botanicals. Again. Well, I got way too much washi tape. Now I might have to share some. Uh, that might be the same one that uh, somebody sent me one of. So let's take a look. If it is, it opens differently. So it don't open the same as the one I got. So I don't know where the one I got came from. If it was a team uh, product or a uh, Amazon, I'm not sure. Oh, no, it's not the same. What is this? It's an inspiration book. It, look at this, guys. This book came with it. With ideas. How to use your washi tape. Isn't that so nice? Well, I will have to try a bunch of these. That is awesome. And look at the colors of this one. Just beautiful, beautiful colors. Oh, my goodness. I love this. Butterflies. There's a little girl in this one. But this is mostly flowers and butterflies. Oh, yes. It's called IB. I guess it's some, some company name. Beautiful. All right, let's see. Ready for washi tape? I don't think I see any washi tape. Okay, let's just keep digging this bag for the fun of it. All right, what is this? This is a whole pack. All right, washi tape, let me get you out of my way. We're going to move these over to the computer side of my table. Try to give us some space because there's a lot of stuff in this pack, guys. I'm not kidding you, there's a lot. And we're going to open this one. Now, these are the silicon stamps. And I got a lot of variety in this one, so... Uh, this is um, a dragonfly. Looks like bubbles in the background. That's a beautiful one. You can see it. I hope you can. This is another dragonfly. Oh, wow. These are beautiful. Look at this butterfly. That will make a beautiful background, especially in my collages that I'm working on. Right now, I am really, besides, well, right, right now, I am actually... Um, cataloging all my stamps and everything and all my uh, clip art into a uh, a notebook system which I'll probably run really get one of my notebooks before we end this video and let you see that but let's go on with these these will make beautiful backgrounds on my collages oh yes I love all this word because I'm always wanting I, I like a lot of text in in my stamping so those are nice that's a beautiful set I got one, two, three, four, five, six, and I'm probably, I'm not going to swear, but I know I didn't pay over $5 for anything, so I don't know why I paid for this, but it was $5 or under, and I got that many sets. I got six stamps on that one. All right, let's lay it aside. What do we got here? Okay, this, I think, are papers. Let's Let's see what we got in here. What kind of papers these are. Okay. Oh, these will be great in my collage. And again, they're kind of neutral. And I'll be using these in my background collaging. Aren't they cute? Yep. Love the variety here. I think I'm flipping. Some of them are one way. And I, they're not double-sided, though. So be, be, be aware of that. But I will use these in my collaging. There's a whole set there. And this was called... Infamy, I don't know. Infamy. Um, chapter by chapter is what that was called. These books are called chapter by chapter. So I'm going to put these back in because I am going to want to list them down below for you guys in case you want to go and continue and find them. That way I can put the category number on there. All right. That was that side. What do we got here? Oh, a larger piece. All right, let's open this one. These are some mushrooms, it looks like. What's the name of this one, if I've got a name on it? Uh, my name on this side. It says Elements. I don't know, guys. There's no name. So, again, when I list this, I'll just have to put the product number on it. But these are beautiful pages. 
are butterflies. All of them are, are moths. These are moths. They're not butterflies. These are moths. They're beautiful, aren't they? Just pretty, pretty, pretty pages. I love them. Looks like I've got three of each kind. We'll go through them real quick. But they are absolutely beautiful quality prints. They are in the subtle colors that I like when I'm doing backgrounds. I like my background to be kind of neutrally, even though the, the moths are, are really bright. But yeah, it looks like there's three of each design in here, guys. These, these are beautiful. Okay, so that's that. And these are one, two, three, four, five and a half by... Eight by five and a half is what these are. So that's a good size. That's a good size. I mean, I would almost make a journal page for me. A whole journal page. All right, so that's that one. I'm just reaching in, blinding, grabbing. Okay, oh, my rabbit. Oh, he is so cute. I saw somebody actually do a video using this little fella. And when I saw him on Team New, I said, oh, yeah, got to have him. He is so cute. Matter of fact, I'll probably give my husband's Father's Day card using these stamps. But these are silicon stamps. And the name of this one I did, I don't remember. It was something rabbit or bunny or something. It's not a name on it. That's a shame that there's not a name on it. You don't get an invoice. I didn't get an invoice back in here with this. So I don't even know what these are called. I will go on my um, order form and see if I have names. Like I say, I will try to list it below. I'll try to be more thorough with this video and list things in the description below to help you guys out if there's anything you really see you want. And if I fail to mention it in the description, you're, you're welcome to comment and text me about it and I will look it up for you. Alright, what have I got here? Alright, more papers. I don't remember ordering all these papers. These might have been some of the gifts that they just gave me free. Okay, same thing with the birds. You got three of each pattern, but again, the very background itself is neutral, and I love that. But beautiful, beautiful stuff. All right, this is the bird papers. I really love them. We are going to have so much fun when we start doing junk journals, because I'm going to use these in my junk journals. Yes, yes, yes. Beautiful. All right, let's reach our hand in there and grab something else. What else we got? More papers. <gasps> Look at this, guys. Bees. Oh, aren't they pretty? Let's see how this one got sealed by this scoop up here. So we're going to open it. Oh, there it is. I thought that will have a flap. There it is. Oh, these are already ready to fold in half. I can make a miniature book with these, and that's exactly, probably, most likely, matter of fact, what I will do with these is I will make a greeting card journal using these. And again, you've got, well, this one, you've got two of each pattern, it looks like, maybe. But, yep, I'm going to do a greeting card journal with these. Make me a small mini greeting card journal. I already know my mind, and this is a good thick paper too. It's not thin. It's um, this is a good quality paper here. What whoever um listed this on Timu is, you, yeah, they use a good print. That might have been a duplicate to the first one we had. And then there's just a honey background. Man, these are absolutely gorgeous, guys. Oh my gosh, and it is, it is almost time for me to do something with sunflowers. I always do something in the summer with sunflowers, so it's almost time to do that. Absolutely gorgeous. Bear with me. I want to put everything back in the package so I can get you all this. I don't want to mess up. Put that aside. Reach in and grab something else. Another stamp. Oh, this is just a number stamp, but it's one big stamp individual stamp and I'll do this on my collage pages because when I cut it down of course you know you'll cut pieces of it off but that's a nice number stamp reach in what else we're gonna grab this is oh my more bumblebees let's see what this is up oh, it's papers I see it on the back here these are papers too oh we are going to have a pretty 
Bumblebee book. Look at that. Oh my goodness, look at these edges. Aren't they beautiful? They look burnt. Oh, and this is a, this paper's almost feels like vellum. It is, oh my goodness, these are absolutely gorgeous. Oh, I love these papers. Oh, I hope I got me a lot of these burnt edges. Oh my goodness. That was a nice surprise. Oh man, that really gives me an idea of how to design some of my kits. Oh my goodness, that was beautiful. I hope I'm not boring you guys to death. This says, have a good day, so that must be the name of the set. But anyway, that was really pretty. Reach in, what we got to get? Oh, mushrooms. Can't ever go wrong with mushrooms. That's a good neutral item to put in any kit. I love the fact that all these backgrounds are very neutral color. Oh, these are these are kind of the raw edges. See, even though they're not burnt out, that they look edged out a little bit. But yeah, there's my mushroom set. That's really pretty. Hmm, that is pretty. I don't normally go for mushrooms. I, I, I don't remember ordering this, but hey, we'll just go with the flow. Sometimes it's just nice to get things that you get, wouldn't normally order just to try. I love that one. Okay, reach in and grab. New stencil. I love it. That'll be great on, on my copy guide pages. And also, recently, I watched a video this morning, I think it was, of a lady who actually uh, sandwiched these these plastic um, dies in between pages and coffee stain them and when she pulls these off the patterns on there are real dark you gotta look I, I gotta finish watching and run that technique but this would be beautiful there but that is a beautiful stencil that's come in my pack and here I've got something metro retro retro collection so let's see what's retro these are some kind of little cards, and I don't know if you can see it, but this pack looks like an index card, so I will probably... Oh, look at it, it's a pocket. Oh, yeah, you know what, guys? I'll be using this on one of my books. I'm not about to throw that um, piece away. And matter of fact, I'll probably break it apart and look at it, and I'm going to probably make me some tags like that. So thank you, Team you huh? That's a great idea. Uh, I can't really tell you. These are just... Some kind of little small journey cards. I will probably use them uh, as glued on to my um, collage sheet, background sheets. But these are kind of cute. There's quite a few in there. So I like that. I love the pocket. Hey, I like the pockets in better than I like the um, tags and tickets. Whatever they are. Mini journal cards. Whatever they are. But they will be going in collages. Always good to have a little neutral stuff with collage. So there again, there it was. All right, let's reach in. See what else we can grab. All right, well, we're back to the bees. I got me some bees. Oh, so just because, be happy. It's a bee stamp, guys. I hope you can see it without me having to take it completely out. We're going to run out of time. I don't want to overdo. And there's still a lot in here. So we got a bee. Silicon stamp. This, I have no idea. I cannot even see it. So we're going to have to, and there's no refill on this. So we're just going to open this packet right across the top here. Take a look. Got a little box of something here. Have no idea what it is. It is, maybe stickers? Yep, these are stickers. Aren't they cute? Pianos. Their shape, oh yeah, these are gorgeous. These are nice neutral pieces with a little bit of shape to them. They're all cut differently. Yeah, these are really pretty. Oh, look at all these. I just love them. But these do feel like they're stickers. I almost, because the front's kind of shiny, so I'm assuming these are stickers. It feels like it. So, let's stick them back in their little box. After I've scrambled them so bad. You ever do that and now I don't know if I can get it back in the box or if I can get them unscrambled. <laughs> I don't want to waste a lot of time. All right. 
All right, well, I'm just going to set them aside and we'll put them back in their little box. All right, what's next? Oh, yeah, I remember ordering this. This is going to be probably on the edge of some of my book, but it's a big, long strip of these roses. I'm probably going to put this on one of my um, altered um, golden, golden books, little golden books. I've got a bunch of those to work on now, so... And this is fabric, and it feels good, and it's not raveling, so I really like this fabric. So that's a roll of fabric. I don't know how much, but there's right much there. Okay, so let's set that one aside. Grab something else. Let's see, more silicone. I can't believe I ordered so many silicone things. Oh, they didn't have enough. All right, these are stamps that I would use again in my collaging. Just really pretty stamps. All right, then I've got birds. I love my birds. Got me some bird stamps. I've been wanting some bird stamps. Got quite a few there. And what I'll probably do these, I'll probably stamp these on white cardstock and, and watercolor those myself. All right, we got a uh, die cut. Looks like some kind of movie things and die cut frames which I will frame out probably. I will probably cut these, and this is probably something that will get layered on the front of some of my books to give me that lacy effect on my books. All right, let's keep digging. What we got more? More stamps. What is this? I have no idea. I think it's more washi tape. Lord forgive that. I wouldn't see much washi tape after getting so much of the other. But hey, I didn't know. <laughs> Oh, aren't they beautiful? These are roses, and they've also got a lot of the gold um, flecks in them. Really pretty set. Backyard. Back record of the backyard. So these, most logically, assumption, these are stamped um, washi tape too. Yeah, I'm looking at the back. It is washi tape. Oh, yeah, these are pretty. They're kind of neutral colors. I like them. Okay, see those? Really pretty, guys. I love these with the words on them. Okay. Let's grab. What we grab? Oh, this is a corner stamp. You, anybody that watches my videos know I love to put a corner tab on all my pages, so... That's going to come in handy and give me a little bit of more decorativeness than I've been having. These are little miniature tags of some sort. They look like travel tags. We'll pull them out and look at them real quick. This is going to be a long video. I had no idea. Now I'm only halfway through this bag, guys. All right, what we got here? Yep, these are just tags. Uh, they feel like stickers, too, so... I'm not sure, but I believe these are sticker tags. Again, great for my collaging. Lots of different size pieces in here. And it's that neutral, those neutral colors that I just really like when I'm collaging. I don't, I, I, I like to do my collages kind of neutral. Because if I want to use a tag that I've made from the collage on one of my I can't get this open back up now, right where it's closed at. I like to use the collages on some of my journal kits that have that are very specific with colors, like my my like my um, mint, mint purple lavender mint Odyssey has a mint green and a lavender. And um, if I've got neutral tags and all, I can add a piece of clip art from the kit and and dress up those yet yeah, make them way ahead of time. So that's why I like the neutrals. Um, more stamps, great for collaging. And that's what I mostly use stamps for, guys. I will tell you, stamps are just, I use them for collaging. These are more stickers, I think. These are called memories. We're going to open them. And it's got another one of those cute little um, envelopes that it's held in. I just love this, whoever's doing this. These are not stickers. These are just pieces of paper that you glue down, but they are very, well, I don't know. Now, that looks like it might be a sticker. Give me a second here. I'm going to look at this thing. 
Give me a, you know what, guys? These are stickers. How about that? Ha! Huh. They didn't feel like a sticker on the front, but that's exactly what these are. These are stickers. So that's going to save me on some glue. And again, I love the pocket that it's in. So, great idea. We'll do a video on making these pockets once I broke it down and looked at it. I really like this pocket. It's funny that the, that the packaging is, is exciting as a thing. Okay, I got me a new um, brush thing for my dyes because I have the worst time getting the stuff out. So, I got me a new brush. This is where I can lay my dye on it and just roll the stuff out. So, man, I'm putting this right up here because we're going to be using that immediately. Because I've got some lace I need to cut out. What's over in this corner of this box? Okay, got more stamps. We got more of those stickers. These are birds. So it's a little different design. What does the top say? It doesn't tell me what the name of this one is. So we'll go look it up and get it in the description. There's that. And that stamp. Okay, more stickers. Let's see what these look like. These are pretty big. I don't remember ordering these, but... Like I say, they, they gave me some free gifts for ordering. Oh, these are nice. Different sizes. And they're stickers also. So, I'm uh, probably using these right on journal pages because they're a little too large for my tags or my um, journal card. Well, some of my journal cards would be great because the ones I put in the great, uh, in the altered books are big, big journal cards. So, they will work on those. So, that's what those are inspirational stickers what's next goodness all right come on let's get to the bottom of this okay this is pure gold washi tape right there i'm not gonna open it you guys can see that i think okay this team haul was so fun um oh mushrooms i didn't have many mushroom stamps so i did get a few of those what's next I have no idea what this is. I would have had to open it up. Oh, it's a little, it's a, a paper. It's papers. It's a little booklet of papers. This one says cottage. Something collage. I don't know. It says something collage. And I tell you what, I like this piece that it's put down with. So it's got to be, this is a vellum. It is a beautiful piece and I'm going to save it. I will actually use that i don't know what these are oh look at these these are just absolutely beautiful little papers good quality neutral colors we will be collaging with those no problem all right what's next in this big bag all right looks like more papers of some sort Oh, I like the I like this wrap around. We will use this. I'll cover the back, but I'm going to use that as a wrap around. I love it. Oh, these are nice. They're like advertising prints, and they've got odd cuttings on the sides. They're not just square. They've actually got pieces cut out. But that's what these are advertising on the neutral colors. Oh yeah, love it, love it, love it. I do love that. This has been a fun pack. I'm just excited. I can't wait to get to work now. Alright, let's see what else we got in here. What is this? More stickers of some sort. A lot of these stickers were a part of the gift for ordering. I got two gifts. Buy one, get one free. Buy one, get a surprise. Something like that. But there are lots of different stickers in here. Lots and lots of variety. Don't look like there's a lot of duplicate either, so that's really nice to get a lot of variety in that. Try to get them back in here because I do not want them to get lost while we're trying. Because like I say, I am in the back of my shop here already with with three ring binders and on um, protector sheets making um storage for all this stuff. What's next? I think I got another washi tape. All right, yeah, this is for the fall. I bought this for the fall, and they are um like you can see you can see them the mostly fall the fall leaves and the butterflies the fall late late summer flowers which that right there is a 
is a pansy, and that's really an early summer flower here. But they're beautiful. I, I can't say I don't have any washi tape now, can I, guys? Hmm, this might be a duplicate. I don't remember ordering two of these, but we'll see. It may be a duplicate. Okay. Oh no, this is a jungle one, so it's not. It's not a duplicate. Uh, the other one was the backyard. This is. I'm gonna try to get in it. They really wrap these things up good. Okay. Let's see what we got. Song of, Dad, Song of Dad. Yeah, these are soft, neutral colors. And they are, are like music sheets, um, inspirational words, butterflies, just kind of a neutral green, more butterflies. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Much happy with that one. All right, let's see what else we got. We, we got about to get in the bottom now, guys. All right, I got more bird stamps here. Ooh, I don't get too close. The light's flaring, really, isn't it? All right, can you see it that good? So let's just pull it out. I mean, I got to make sure you can see it. Not much good to show you a haul if you can't see the product. All right, maybe that's not as glaring, okay? Beautiful birds. There again, I will probably stamp these on a heavy cardstock or water paper color and watercolor these and cut them out with my new stamp scissors. Yes, I got um, I got those little, it's called mini, mini pinking scissors and they're by Frisca, Fris, Fris, whatever. Anyway, I got me a pair and they're perfect for making stamps. These are more mushroom stamps with writing in the background. I really like those. And this is more paper. It looks very neutral. We'll take a look at it. I love the um. I love this stuff that they they've used for. I don't know where they got all this wrap from, but this is perfect too to keep and use. So I will use the wrapping. Again, this is a nice neutral book that I'll use in collaging. I love it. It is really pretty. Okay. Go for that. And what else we got? Uh, this is my glue stand. I'm having I was having trouble with my hot glue gun, so I bought me a stand for my glue to sit on. So we'll put it together later. But oh gosh, it's man, it sticks. Oh, I want to stick that tight. Yeah, that sticks. So we'll set that aside. That's gonna go for my glue gun. And what else we got? We got another stamp. It's got just a lot of writing on it. And we've got more writing papers that are kind of neutral, but a lot of writing. Again, I love these in my collaging. Oh, and they got those burnt edges also. These are absolutely gorgeous with those burnt edges. Oh, just love them, love them, love them. Yeah, a little bit of rough cutting on some of them. If you've been hesitant to buy from Team Year, let me tell you a little secret that I did. I have a computer that I don't use for my business a lot, and I order Team Year off that computer. So that if there's any issues, you can't get any, get any of my information. So, but I've not had any trouble with Team Year at this time, point in time, guys, and I am very, very pleased with the product. This is another one of those beautiful um, wraps they use. I can't find the end of it. There it is. No, I can't find it. So I'm going to slide it off. I would definitely keep this for myself as a something I use. But these sheets are not quite so neutral, but they are in a way. These are just beautiful. These have got more, a little more color, and I like that every once in a while. So these are beautiful too. I really cannot wait to get collaging with all this new stuff that I have. And guys, I think that's that's the end of the pack. So that was the end of my Timu haul. I hope you enjoyed seeing all the goodies. And I hope if you got a uh, Timu haul, you'll share with us too. And again, 
I'm going to reiterate one more time how much I appreciate whoever sent me the washi tapes. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it more than you can know. And we're going to now go get these all filed away and stored. So when we get ready to do some more pages in our book, which we are still working on, the Ultra Green Card book. I'm going a little slow in it, but we'll get it done. Get it done soon. Like I say, having to round up this shop plus being, not, being a little under the weather. I have not been able to do a whole lot of that. But anyway, this is Nana K saying thanks for watching. I hope you'll like and subscribe. Uh, mention me on other sites so people will come and visit me. I'm having a real struggle getting my video hours up to get monetized. Monetize, I, I really need to get monetized if I'm going to keep doing this. Got to make a few dollars if I'm going to keep doing this and I really want to retire. I'm almost 70 years old and it would be my great joy to be able to retire. So please share my videos with others and spread the word about Nana K Designs and visit me often. Uh, hope to see you again soon. Bye bye. It's been a lot of fun sharing my haul with you today and my rack um, gifts. Thanks.